kufuatilia kinachojiri na utakuwa ni mwenye kutujuza kwa faida ya watazamaji wetu. Na mtukiachana na masuala ya maandamano kiduchu ni kwamba wazalishaji wa mafuta ya kula wanapitia kipindi cha misoko suko ya kiuchumi kufuatia uamuzi wa serikali wa kuagiza bidhaa hiyo kutoka nje bila kutoza ushuru aidha sekta hiyo inakabiliwa na changamoto za kuagiza malighafi na upungufu wa dola ya Marekani hali ambayo inafanya kampuni zao zalishaji wa mafuta ya kupikia kuzorota sasa kampuni hizo zina warai wa kulima wadogo wadogo wajiunge zaidi na kilimo cha mimea inayo zalisha mafuta ya kula ndipo sawafikie azma ya soko la kimataifa mkurugenzi mkuu wa kampuni ya Bitco Oil Chris Diaz anasema kwamba kampuni hiyo inafanya uzalishaji wa mafuta kwa asilimia hamsini pekee kutokana na changamoto wanazokabiliana nazo katika sekta hiyo Diaz amesema kwamba sasa wakulima hapa nchini hawapandi mimea ambayo ina maligafi kuu ya uzalishaji wa mafuta hali ni wapa changamoto na kupelekea upungufu wa dola alisema hayo wakati wa kampuni ya Bitco ilipotembelea ilipotembelewa na maafisa kutoka Wizara ya Biashara na Uwekezaji huko nchini and all our raw materials especially contract farmers we have 30 to 40000 farmers supplying us with raw materials and we are requesting and kindly requesting for more farmers to supply us with soya sunflower and other products that we can uh, give back to agribusiness we have been doing this for many years and we will continue to use all our uh, agribusiness in terms of even forward uh, distributorship of our animal feeds so that contributes back to the agriculture industry we are trying to make sure that Kenya is sustainable uh, we are going to try and reduce our over reliance on importation and uh, the best way to see this was to come to the factory and uh, try and understand their challenges yeah they can explain to us what they believe is the best approach to tackle the existing problems and I'm really grateful for Bidco we have gotten the best uh, hospitality available they have shown us their factory we have seen some concerns the factories are running at low capacity and it's our wish that the, the, the government can try and incentivize and help them grow their, their production capacity Mtazamaji hayo ya kijeri ni kwamba Kenya na Djibouti zinatarajiwa kuanza shughuli za kuongoza